So I am very happy to uh, greet you after the end of the assembly of all conferred uh, our presenting Cambodia delegation. And it's probably the last animation visit I accomplished during these six years at the East Asia Oceania Regional Council. Uh, first of all, I would like to give thanks to all, especially to the delegates of the Council, who contributed to the constant growth of the delegation in the past six years in many ways. And especially it's about um, uh, rejoicing with uh, the first generation of commercial agents who are growing well already up to the stage of practical training. In spite of so many external challenges and social, political, cultural changes in the country, we are able to go through. And in the same time, we were able to strengthen the formation. Uh, went through in all these difficult economic times, and in the same time also reshape uh, our mission, not only in the technical schools, but the direction towards the poor young people in this new situation of Cambodia. Of course, the challenges uh, don't leave us. We try to embrace them. Uh, although we consolidated our communities, we are still not in all places, uh, really a fully fledged uh, Salesian community of four as we be perpetually profit, however, uh, moving in that direction. And of course, uh, to express fully the Salesian charisma in Cambodia, we start uh, the commission animation of the sectors like social communication, planning development office, youth ministry, mission animation formation, However, it is still starting stage, so the challenge is obvious to carry on constant animation of the conquerors and especially our lay mission partners, because we are so few and they are many. After 27 years in uh, this Kingdom of Cambodia, the Salesian charism is growing. And the visit of Father Angel Fernandez Artime, Director Major, three years ago, uh, of course, was a big push, inspiration, and expression that the province of Thailand, Cambodia, Laos is joining together, the region is supporting, and of course, the Rector Major from his council try to support in any possible way. However, there are a few priorities for the next future, which we discern in this assembly, and still we need to work on more concrete expression. The first would be about uh, being able to strengthen our community that the ongoing formation will be part of our daily life, not just through events, although it's very important. We are happy that the practical training have their regular meetings. However, still in each place we are not yet able to make community day, and all these little things of ongoing formation may happen with consistency. Then, of course, second uh, priority would be to don't lose the focus on the poor young people, and we are grateful to God for these 25,000 young men and women who receive education through Don Bosco in this country. Uh, we, in this new situation, uh, which is a very fast developing country, uh, it's not, it may be easy to lose the track on poor young people as the place where God is calling us to meet him. And the third uh, priority is maybe connected to this uh, in some places like Sihano will really upsetting situation when the, when the changes are so fast. We may lose track also on the most important thing of every missionary to really share the faith through our witness, through our little talk with the lay people and with the young. Uh, we know that the gospel is whispered in this country in many different ways. However, our worry about uh, administration, economy, management, so many institutions may uh, prevent us to be focused on uh, the first and the last, the most important initial proclamation of gospel here. I am living for the next destination in Thailand. And I'm happy that uh, really the accompaniment of the delegation produced many fruits. And I wish Cambodia delegation will also grow in communion with the region and with the worldwide congregation, 
which is the only way how to really have strong Salesian charism in this place. And we pray for new generations of our Cambodian Salesians as well. May God bless you.